Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be doing a demo on the Sweets Party Pocky Mold. So here are all the things you'll be needing. Of course you'll be needing some Pocky, and I purchased these at Daiso, but you can get them at any Japanese market. You'll also be needing this mold, and I picked this up at Daiso too, but unfortunately I do not think they sell them anywhere besides Daiso. So, if you guys do not have a Daiso near you, I would just suggest going online for it. And lastly, you'll be needing some chocolate chips, and they don't have to be anything special. I just picked up my cheapest brand at my local supermarket. So, the first thing we are going to do is we are going to wash this mold because it was probably laying in Daiso for a long time and we don't know who or what could have touched it, so just to be safe, it is smart to wash your mold before you use it. While we're waiting for the mold to dry, we are going to start boiling some water, and I'm only going to fill the pot halfway because later we're going to need some extra room to start melting the chocolate. Since boiling water requires using a stove, I would suggest having a parent help you out with this step. So once your water is finished boiling, then you can get a metal bowl like this and fill it with chocolate chips. And I do want to mention that your metal bowl should be small enough so that it fits in the pot because we are going to need to put this in the pot next. So what you're going to do is you're going to put your metal bowl in the pot and you're going to keep stirring the chocolate chips until they melt. Once your chocolate is nice and melted like this, then we can move on to the next step. So now you're going to get your mold and fill it halfway with the melted chocolate. Once your mold is filled halfway with the melted chocolate, then you can add your Pocky. So now we're just going to add some more melted chocolate on top of the Pocky so we can cover it. Now that your Pocky is completely covered with chocolate, we can put the mold in the freezer. So I waited about 15 minutes to take out my mold and now the Pocky is ready. So as you can see, they now have these really cute flower and heart patterns on them. So I hope you guys enjoyed this demo and hopefully you guys can all try this out on your own. So thanks for watching. Bye!